I suppose it's arguably the first three seconds. It is supposed the biggest game in the league. How is it for you, and how are the girls feeling ahead of it? <laughs> I think they're uh, really looking forward to to these occasions, you know. Um, just as you just as you said there, yeah, as a as a bigger a bigger game if you like want to want to categorise it in that that way, you know. Um, but we've had a good week. Um, disappointed we never managed to get the game under our belt last Sunday. However, these things these things happen in football, and it's how you adapt and you adjust, you know. And I think the girls we managed to get a training session um, slotted in, which was great, and then we just uh, prepared as normal um, the rest of this week. What can three points do to you against Glasgow City? Because it's so tight, and I know it's tight against most teams and stuff like that. But you know, with both sides winning so often, and you can include Celtic maybe in heads in that aspect. When you play against each other, and when you get the three points over each other, how big can that be? Long. I think, Ron. I think the most important thing, just as you said, is it's the three points, no matter who you're playing. However, you know, what what it does for the group is, is it gives that confidence, you know, and it gives you that um, forum, if you like to start talking about forum, you know, you get, you're in a run a forum. And I think that's another experience that the girls will, um, will get come time and in, in this league, you know. So I think it's it's a matter of maintaining the, the levels of performance that we've had from from the girls, um, no matter what the, what the tie is, whether it's home or it's away, and that we have the, the preparation, the due diligence in our preparation, um, getting ready for the game, so we're really looking forward to it here. There's also a good measure to see just exactly where you, you and the girls are in terms of Glasgow City, you know, Champions League team last year and stuff like that, and you know, did well this year. Is this a good measure for yourself? Is this the, the games that you and the girls want to measure yourself in and relish playing in? Yeah, definitely. This, this is a yardstick, just as you've said there. You know, Glasgow City are the champions. Um, they have been for a number of years. Um, they've got that kind of aura about themselves where they're used to winning. Um, Glasgow Rangers are, we're, we're new into the league, we're new into the professional setup, um, you know, and we're, we're, we're going about things the exact same way as the, as the clubs always always run. So yeah, it'll be, it'll be good. It'll be good come this Sunday to yardstick ourselves and 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 see see how we how we fare against against the champions. Looking back against the, the game against Hibs, that must give you a lot of confidence. You know, the, the character that, that the side showed that day was something was maybe a wee bit different because we're usually you know seeing Rangers on the front foot and, and doing very well. That must give you confidence going into a game like this where maybe you might not get it all your own way, but you still have that inner grit to, that there's something in this squad that, that's a never-say-die attitude. Yeah, definitely. I think we've, we've always tried to install a winning mentality. Um, when you play with Rangers Football Club, you must win. Uh, there's no there's no um, second guessing it at all there. So the, the mentality has got better since the, the programme started. And I think uh, it was none more so than when we, we last played Hibs, we, we actually scored and we, we got the 1-0 and we, we, we maintained the league, the lead, sorry. Um, and then obviously we, we played them at home there and we went a goal down. And so it was a different challenge that the, the girls faced. But I think the confidence that's that's came about the group um, through time, through effort, um, through a lot of practice has, um, has really equipped them well. Um, and they have that inner belief, that inner desire, and they fully, they're fully aware of what it is to play with Glasgow Rangers, and, and maintaining the standards in order to, you know, not just in training, daily in training, but to make sure that that can be put into practice come come matches.